Hi. So, so, so you guys were pretty consistent at home, but the last three or the last four there, what's what's kind of going on at Staples Center? Uh, hmm. uh, well, we played uh, three good teams, so you have to give, give credit to the opponents. Um, but uh, you know, again, now we're we're not being we're not playing as consistent as we were at home. Um, so uh, so you know, we played well for stretches, uh, but it's it's not enough. You know, the teams keep keep grinding, keep keep working hard, and uh, keep fighting, and then at the end they, they make runs on us. Uh, I think that that's what we have to change a little bit. We have to change the perception of guys, of teams, believing that they can come back on us uh, due to our inconsistency. How do you guys go about changing the perception? Uh, it takes discipline, it takes concentration, it takes valuing every play and doing the right thing every time. You know, you're going to make mistakes, but at least keeping the level of intensity and, and, and execution in both ends. Yeah, yeah. Every team is going to be dangerous, uh, and they are too. Uh, obviously, they they playing they're shorthanded, but you know, we know we know how they played the last game there and how hard it was for us to, to win there too. Um, so um, so we just have to know, regardless who we play, we just have to do the, the same thing. We've got to be consistent with our principles, with our game plan, uh, regardless of who we're facing. And that's how you build on things and how that's how you get stronger and take steps forward instead of one step forward, two steps backwards, uh, and stuff like that. Yeah. It's a team like Oklahoma City that has so much speed. Is, is that philosophy still the same? I mean, you're going to take mm -hmm. what you have to play them and not yeah with a, it with a team like Oklahoma it takes even more concentration and more discipline uh, it takes better execution uh, on the offensive end to limit uh, long shot long rebounds and limit transition points because uh, they have so many guys that can push obviously with Westbrook being the main one uh, so it's even more magnified against a team like Oklahoma what's going on with your guys defense I know Mike's concerned are you concerned that you've kind of slipped uh, last few games, we just gave up, giving up too many, too many. Uh, it seems like it's not a, seems like it's not, it's not a priority, uh, and it needs to be. Uh, I mean, regardless of, of, uh, of yes, it is important to attack well, and yes, sometimes it does carry over uh, from the offensive end by being by having bad possessions. Um, we still need to be solid defensively, and um, you know it hasn't really happened. Uh, we're relying too much on our offense, and uh, we're scoring points, but sometimes we don't score enough to uh, to, to beat the opponent. Yeah, is it a head thing or a heart thing? Uh, you know I mean? it's always. I think it's always a mixture of both. A mix of both. Uh, you know, you got to put your head and your heart into into stuff to to make it work. And uh, you know, when you combine both uh, at the high at a high level, you're probably going to be successful. At least you can. Get out of the game, saying I gave my all, and uh, it just, you know, didn't didn't work out that tonight. What's the mood of the team been like between back to back from losses and the issues mm -hmm. that went on there? Just hasn't been, I guess, as fun a week as the last week. <laughs> Uh, obviously, uh, win, winning makes makes everything more fun. Um, uh, so um, so once we get back to winning, yeah, I think. Things will, will start to be a little more fun, um, but uh, obviously, again, it takes a little, a little more discipline, it takes a little more uh, concentration than uh, what we have had in the last couple games. I think. Uh, you talked on, on Tuesday about Andrew and making sure that everybody was invested mm -hmm. and on the same page. Uh, mm -hmm. right. Did you guys ever have any conversations? Has that changed at all? What's your view on him mm -hmm. just in the last couple of days and what it all means? Mm, well, we, well, like I said, we, we talk uh, within, within the team. We talked uh, uh, to I talk to him. I, you know, people talk to him. I think that uh, uh, we talk to each other. I mean, uh, it's a team, and we're trying to make it work. Uh, and we know we need everyone to make this work and have and have a better chance um, ultimately. So, uh, so this would uh, I think uh, had a great effort last night. Right, 25 and 13. Mm -hmm. It's a pretty good game uh, for anyone, anyone, and um, and uh, we try to hit that same kind of uh, effort uh, on a consistent basis, uh, regardless of the opponent. Thanks, guys.